Want to make sure you never miss a Kindly Kian video again? Be sure to subscribe and hit that bell to turn on notifications. I think he might be chasing us. I'm very, very concerned. Oh my gosh. He obliterated me. Hello, everybody. I am Kindly Kian and welcome back to Feed and Grow Fish. So they've updated the game and they've kind of reworked the entirety of the swamp level. And then they've also updated the multiplayer, but it's still not exactly all there. But the main reason that I wanted to play today is because they've added a new enemy, a new boss, if you will, to the great map. So we're going to try this out and face the new boss. So you might be asking, what is is this new boss on the great map well if you guys recall we have the mosasaurus right and he's kind of just looming around all over the place just eating everything in his path and then we also have the sperm whale which is really really cool and that was added when they added the whole like arctic area that's a cool little boss but now they've added another one and it is the megalodon and i really want to check this guy out i don't know exactly where he is but i would like to see him and find him first make sure that he's actually here this is as i understand it this is where he likes to hang out but i don't know exactly where so we have to go on a megalodon scavenger hunt yes we're we're actually seeking out one of the most fearsome creatures in the ocean as it stands and will eat us in an instant we're looking for this creature why would we do that that seems like a very bad decision if we want to continue living but whatever it's a risk I'm willing to take. So I want to find him first, and then once we find him, then we'll start building up, and and maybe we'll uh, we'll try out some of the other. Oh wait, is that him? Is that that? I think that was him. Oh my gosh. Yep. Yeah, that is definitely a megalodon. Let's get a closer look on this guy. Oh my gosh. That is a mean looking fishy. Holy cow. Look at all those like, I don't know if those are gills or scars. This guy looks like he's seen some stuff. This is like a grizzled war veteran of the ocean. Holy moly. I want to get closer though. He's so fast. Slow down, dude. So, don't, don't eat me though. Like just please don't eat me. This guy looks awesome. I really like the way that this Megalodon looks. He he honestly looks prehistoric. He looks like a dinosaur. He straight up looks like a shark version of a dinosaur. That is really, really cool. Okay, so obviously we don't stand a chance against him. In fact, like he didn't even care about us. Like I was right in his face and he's like, this little guy, I don't... <laughs> It's like not even an appetizer for me. I need a real more substantial piece of meat. So he didn't even care that we were by him. So we haven't even gotten to the point where the Megalodon will pay attention to us. I at least want to get to the point where he wants to eat me. I would prefer that he doesn't eat me. I would actually prefer that we eat him. But regardless, I want some recognition from this guy. So we have a lot of work to do. We got to get to the point where we can actually fight that guy. And we may end up like switching out fish. I, I think I wanted to see maybe like put the orca up against the megalodon. I think that would be a pretty cool battle of the ages. So maybe we'll end up doing that. I'm not sure how many coins we need to get to the orca. So I'm just going to I'm just going to start eating things because that's what Bebos do. They eat stuff and they eat starfish and they eat other fish that don't eat them back. I'm going to go eat these dories. Come here dory dory what are you doing where are you going you sneaky little fish come here yeah see i got my whole family on you now we're gonna eat you all together please please come back it's been a while since i've actually played this game so i'm still kind of getting back into the groove of things I, I was never very good at the game but you know i mean it's a very like relaxing just kind of kickback game you just cruise around until you get eaten that's always a sad and disappointing situation there's also a great white shark right underneath us so maybe we shouldn't be down here but it is kind of like a relaxing little game and then you know you get to a certain level and you're like yeah i got this and then suddenly something just flies out of the blue and eats you whole and then you're dead and you have to start all over that's always very frustrating so hopefully we can avoid that happening today but we'll see come on man. go away my sea urchin i saw it first i saw it first get out of here <sighs> he's he doesn't care 
he, he's gonna take my food forever. Oh, that's a sea turtle. Hello. Hello. Okay, I'm I'm leaving. I am not liking it here. Do I have gang? Oh, you know what it is? I had gang mode on. Now all my Bebo's buddies are gonna follow me around because I had the stupid thing on. I turned it off. And now all this delicious XP is ours. He's not. He's not biting back. He's so dead. This guy is so done. Look at that. Dead crab right there. No, don't you dare. Don't. Oh, you. You. <laughs> You're lucky, buddy. You're lucky I'm in a good mood today. My worst enemies are my own family. Ooh, we're in anglerfish territory. Probably don't want to be in anglerfish territory because they have big and very sharp teeth. and They're great for chewing on on smaller fish like myself so let's just not go over there okay i'm eating fish in mahi mahi territory i'm kind of scared i saw a delicious fish oh yeah look at that mahi mahi right there <laughs> okay that's a little too risky for me Ooh, we found sea urchin and crab you know what this might be a good spot to hang out for a little bit let's get this crab level six that's what I'm talking about. We got 15 coins. I think that the Orca is like 200 coins or something like that. So yeah, we, we've got a long ways to go, but a little bit at a time. Slow and steady wins the race. All those nice little adages. Let's keep reminding ourselves. We got this. Also, all of these turtles. Oh my gosh, like a hundred turtles just spawned in this area and uh, they will eat me. They will absolutely eat me. Can I leave? Can, can I please get out of here, please? Jeez. Yeah, I didn't like it there. We're back in Bebo's town. I don't like being in Bebo's town. I don't like my family. They interrupt me. They take my food. They're bossy and pushy. They're just, they're just not very nice fish. And I don't want to be associated with these people anymore. I think around level 10, we can probably start actually like doing some, some proper work, fighting some bigger fish, getting some good XP, but we're not quite there yet. Not quite. Eat some jellyfish along the way. Eat some uh, Nemo's. Come here, Nemo. Sorry. This is how the movie ends. You get eaten by a Bebos. I'm so sorry. Finding Nemo 3. Here it is. Spoilers. Oh, so sad. So sad. Oh, another Nemo. Finding Nemo 4. It all ends again. Okay, we've hit level 10. There is these, uh, these creepy, like, shrimp type crab guys. They do a lot of damage, though. I've gotten into fights with those guys, and they do a lot more damage than you might expect from a little shrimp. They don't like being called shrimp. Ooh. Some floating meat. I love free fish food. Please, give it to me. Oh yeah, here we go. Come on, get it all quicker. I'm, I'm a little scared. <laughs> a little bit nervous about picking someone's leftovers. You never know, they might come back. Looks like we're okay though. And we hit level 11. What about these Mahi Mahi? Do you think we're big enough yet? I don't know. This, this is a bad choice. That was, that was a very, very, dumb decision oh so that's exactly what i'm talking about you work so hard to get to a certain point and it's all taken away in an instant because you make a bad decision and that was a very bad decision all right it's okay we have 40 coins so we can upgrade to a bigger and better fish let's see where should we go actually before we pick our next fish let's just see how much an orca is 150 okay so at least we know what we're aiming for we've got 40 we could be a hammerhead that might actually be pretty fun or it could be a mahi mahi we could become what just ate us. Let's do the hammerhead shark. I've never played as the hammerhead shark on the ocean map, so let's do it. Oh my gosh, a billion hammerhead sharks just spawned with me. So I'm just gonna leave because they're gonna pick every single thing that is edible in this area dry. So uh, let's go after the zebra fish. Come here. Oh, zebra. Oh, you poor thing. Oh, barracudas. Hello. Please don't eat me. And we got this cool like radar ability. I guess we can find food if we press E. I don't think I've ever used that. So we'll have to try that out. Ooh, cuttlefish. Oh, it's, it's a bad day for you, buddy. It's a very, very bad day. You are dead. All right, that was some excellent XP. Let's try this radar thing. What does that do? How does that? I don't quite understand what that is doing. I don't have any kind of indicator on my map. I don't know. I'm kind of confused how this works. Oh, there you go. Oh, there. Yeah. Okay. You can see them through walls and stuff. You think I can eat this guy? Oof. This is risky. Oh, boy. Oh, Goliath fish. 
No. Oh, he's hurting me. He's definitely hurting me, but I'm hurting him. I just need to hurt him more than he hurts me. That's how it works. Amazing. More of those next level strats that I'm sharing with you guys. Oh boy. Oh, this... He's... He's not going down. Is he dead? Oh, he's dead. Now, can we please chew this guy up into smaller bits that I can actually consume for XP? Please nobody take my XP. This is very good XP. Okay. We got all the XP for ourselves. And look at... We've got as many coins as we had as the stinking Bebos in like two minutes. Whereas it took like 20 minutes to get to this point with the Bebos. So yeah, Hammerhead Shark, pretty cool. Let's eat some Mahi Mahi. Let's get some revenge for eating that Bebos. Yeah, this is what you get. Take down this Mahi Mahi. Now this is probably not the Mahi Mahi that ate us when we were the Bebos. So I apologize for my misdirected vengeance, but you look a lot like him, all right? Oh, Megalodon. Oh no, don't, don't you dare come after me. I'm not ready for this battle. I'm not ready for this. Yeah, yeah, that's right, that's right. Yeah, you go the other way. Pretty sure he's scared of me. I can't really blame him, I am pretty tough. I still wanna eat a turtle. Come here, turtle. Oh, he's running. He's running, he knows what's coming for him. Come here, come here, stop running away. Now this guy's probably gonna be kinda tough to, to, eat, but, uh, hopefully the XP's worth it. Still going at it. He's still trying to get away. He's still not dead. He's a tough little bugger, aren't you? Just embrace your fate. Stop running away. I really like turtles, and I do kind of feel bad eating this guy, but a shark's gotta do what a shark's gotta do, and he's finally dead. Finally. That took forever. By forever, I mean, like, 45 seconds. Totally not worth it, I would say. I don't feel like the XP that we're getting out of all that work was worth what we had to go through to get it. Okay, we're definitely getting closer to Orca mode. We have 60 more coins we need to get. You think we can take on this Goliath? I think we can. I, I mean, we, we got one before and we were a lower level. So I feel like we can take this guy down. Although this one might be a little bit bigger than the one that we killed last time. I'm actually a little bit nervous about this. He's, he's doing quite a number on us. I don't particularly like this. Yeah, my health is getting a little bit lower than it did the last time we fought one of these guys. Oh my gosh. Okay, that was scary. We got him, but again, that was way too close for comfort. Oh, but look at that XP. Oh, that is so good. That'll take us to level five. Heck yeah, level five, 116 coins. I feel like... All we have to do is kill another Goliath, and we should probably have all the coins that we need. Let's, uh, yeah. Oh, oh, I'm scared of the scorpion guys. Th those guys are scary. <laughs> they will, they will poison you, and that's not fun. All right, we got another Goliath battle going on. I think we got this one, though. This one was a little bit smaller than the other one. He wasn't doing quite as much damage, so... That was not hard at all. That got us to 139, so not quite where we need to be, but we are very, very close. There's the Megalodon. I really wanna, I wanna take him down, but I know we're not ready yet. I know that this shark is not even close, and once we get to the Orca, we're gonna have to level up the Orca as well to take down the Megalodon. I don't know at what point we'll be able to, but I guarantee we're gonna have to at least uh, level him up a little bit. Look, each of these guys is giving me one coin. <laughs> it's just a feeding frenzy. Thank you. And there you have it. We've hit 150 coins. So, I guess we'll go out in a blaze of glory. Let's fight the Megalodon. Come here. Where are you going? Why are you running away from me? You scared of me? He's scared of me. I know he's scared of me. Come here, Megalodon. Come here. Come here. Oh, gosh. Oh, I made him very angry. Look it out. the. He killed me in one bite. Just, oh. Did you see all those teeth? Oh my gosh. <laughs> this guy is intense. Holy cow. Woo. All right, so let's switch over to the Orca and let's get this bad boy leveled up to the point where we can take on the Megalodon. I'm very scared though, because that bite destroyed me. One single bite and I was done. So let's make sure that our Orca is highly leveled before taking on the Megalodon. All right, we'll start with these weird guys. These are like Norwegian red fish or something. I, I forget exactly what they're called. Holy cow! No, 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 no! Why? Why was he in there? Big old whale! Just 
hanging out in this little cavern completely ruined my hopes and dreams. Destroyed. Absolutely destroyed. Well, that stinks. We have to start over. We have seven coins. That hurts. That hurts. Yeah. So, uh, back to the Bebos. I guess we could do skeleton Bebos. Because why not? Because I feel dead inside. <laughs> so much work to get to this point. All gone. All right, so I'm gonna work my way back to 150 coins. It's gonna take a while, but I'll get back to you guys as soon as we get the Orca back. Okay, I finally made it back to the Orca. It took some time, a lot of grinding, but uh, this time let's avoid getting eaten by giant whales. I think that sounds like a pretty good plan. So I feel like maybe I should just leave the Arctic area and just go to the normal area of this stage because I don't want to get eaten by giant sharks. Are those seals? Are those, those are seals. What in the world? What? There's seals all over here. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's actually pretty cool. What? They're adorable. They're all over the place and they're kind of scaring me. I feel like they could take me down. I know orca typically eat seal, but uh, who knows? You know, if you get enough seals chasing you down, they might they might take you down. Oh, seal. Seal, you've, you've strayed too far from the pack. I, I'm going to try to eat you, but this could be a very bad decision. Holy cow, I didn't know we could do that. That's awesome. We totally just did a whale breach. I missed the seal though. So, whoops. How about a turtle? Let's eat a turtle. Oh, there's Mosasaurus. Oh, don't wanna mess with him. Definitely do not wanna mess with him right now. Oh my gosh, Mosasaurus, what are you doing here? He's following me. I do not wanna get in a fight with Mosey right now. No, I'm not ready for that. How about some hammerhead sharks? You think we can take these guys on? I think we can take them on. Let's try. Oh, he's running. Oh, he is definitely running away. No, where are you going? Come here. Come here. Got him. I forgot how powerful the orca is. Two bites. That's incredible. Yeah, orcas are awesome. I kind of already knew that, but it's just reminding me of how awesome they are. But we also do need to breathe. So let's go get some air. Okay, that's better. A beautiful orca breach. There we go. And then back into the deep waters to eat some hammerhead sharks. Do you think orca ever eat hammerhead sharks? I highly highly doubt it one bite now we take them down in one bite that is magnificent let's go back to the hammerheads because they are excellent xp for where we're at right now i think i saw the megalodon while i was making my trip up to the surface i don't know exactly where he is but we'll come back to him okay so i fed on the hammerhead sharks until we got to level 10 it actually has been taking a while i think one of the things about the orca that's kind of different from especially like the sharks is that their mouth isn't as big as the sharks so they can't eat creatures whole you still have to chew them down into little bits. So that makes leveling up a lot slower because with the sharks in the past, like what we've done is we found like the spawn point for certain types of creatures. And then you can just hold down right click and you can just vacuum up all of those enemies and get all that XP instantly. You don't even have to bite them. But the orca unfortunately can't really do that. At least as far as I can tell up to this point, we might have to get him a lot bigger uh, to do that. Like for instance, we can't even eat this Goliath fish whole and he's not even as big as some of the sharks that we've eaten in the past. So I think I want to head to a new area. I've spent a lot of time over here. Let's go somewhere new. I don't know where that's going to be yet, but it'll be somewhere different. I wonder if we can eat Mahi Mahi whole. Ooh, we can. So where do they spawn? That's the question. Ooh, should we fight a great white shark? I guess that's a nice warm up, sort of. I'm, I'm scared. I'm very scared. Oh, he's hurting me. He's hurting me, but he's dead. He's dead. We got him. Okay, so that's a good kind of like proof of concept. We can kill a great white shark. That doesn't mean that we can guarantee killing a Megalodon, but you know, I mean, that's a pretty good takedown. Oh, there's Megalodon. I, I'm not ready for this. I'm not ready. Please, please don't be chasing me, please. I think he might be chasing us. I'm very, very concerned. Oh my gosh. He obliterated me. He absolutely destroyed me. I did not stand a chance, even for a moment. Wow. Um, Orca versus Megalodon, clearly. 
Megalodon one. <laughs> okay. Well, we have a lot of coins to spend. So maybe we should just become the whale shark and just become giant and eat the Megalodon as the whale shark. Yeah, I think I wanna do that. I need revenge. So if you remember, the whale shark is essentially the vacuum of the ocean. He doesn't really do a lot of damage, but he has a giant mouth that just sucks up everything in its path and it makes leveling up as this guy incredibly easy. It is very, very easy and it's actually a lot of fun. So we're gonna level this bad boy up to the point where we can just swallow the Megalodon whole. All right, we're moving into seal territory. <laughs> just vacuuming up all of these seals. Oh no, the vacuum of the ocean has arrived. Hello everybody. Oh, can't quite eat the narwhal yet. Okay. I think what I'm gonna do is head over to the spawn area of the hammerhead sharks or maybe even the tiger sharks and we can just suck up all those guys. Oh good, Mosasaurus is over here. Okay, I've changed my mind. I do not want to be here anymore. We got great whites all over here and I really don't wanna mess with them. I know that I'm not big enough to eat them yet, so I'm not gonna mess around with the great white sharks. Here's the hammerhead shark feeding ground. So let's see if we can set this up so that we can get on top of their spawn point and just continually eat them forever. There's a whole bunch over here, so I don't know if they all just spawned over here. Maybe they did. Oh, oh, I think, yep, I think we found it. I think we found the spawn point, oh yeah. Yeah, there's definitely sharks spawning here. They're just a little irregular. I don't, oh, I think they, they, well, there's one that just spawned into my mouth. So that's pretty sweet. I don't know if they're gonna spawn continually. Yeah, it looks like they, they moved. So did they all start spawning? Yeah, see, they all start spawning up here. Okay, all right. That kind of stinks, but I can see why they fixed it. I mean, it is an exploit. You can get pretty much unlimited XP by just standing in the same spot. So they set it up so that these guys spawn in different spots and it kind of rotates between the different spawn spots. So it's not quite as easy as just staying in one spot. If you can find the different spawn points though, you can kind of go back and forth between the two spawn points and you can just eat them all up and then go to the other one and rinse, wash, and repeat. But like I said, not quite as easy as it used to be. Oh well, we'll just make the best of it. We're still getting pretty decent XP, so let me see. Are they spawning over here now? Yep, they sure are. So it looks like there's only two different spawn spots for the uh, hammerhead sharks, which isn't too bad. It would be nice if we could get to the point where we can eat the tiger sharks whole because they seem to spawn over by those ruins and they tend to spawn pretty uh, quickly in just two different spots. I don't know if they fixed it again, but if we can figure out how to make that happen, that could probably be a lot quicker than the hammerhead sharks. So why don't we head over here? So here's the ruins, but uh, there's a, oh, there's a Mosasaurus hanging out here. Okay, that is something that I definitely don't wanna mess around with right now. Oh, he's coming back. He's coming back for me. Please go faster. Please don't eat me. Is he behind me? Where is he? Oh, there he is. Okay. Okay, I kind of hate this area. Even though the tiger sharks are amazing XP, the Mosasaurus kind of figured it out too. And uh, he's kind of uh, got this area on lockdown right now. I'm a little bit nervous. I'm kind of keeping an eye out while picking off some of these bigger fish. Here's another tiger shark. You can see they give us a thousand XP for each one that we eat. That's incredible. But I really don't want to get eaten by the Mosasaurus. Like, seriously. Okay, yep, there he is. Is he, what's he doing? I don't know exactly what he's doing, but I'm gonna try to get the food while I can. Is it, where, where is he? Oh, he's leaving. Maybe, maybe he's leaving? The great white shark is feeding on the tiger sharks right now too, which is kind of scary. Okay, so it looks like the tiger sharks actually have the same spawn spot that they had last time. Oh my gosh, get away from me. Get away from me, that hurt. That hurt very, very badly. Okay, let's, let's not hang out there right now. All right, I'm coming back to the ruins. Oh, there's Mosasaurus. Man, he's still there. I don't think he's gonna leave. <laughs> I really don't think he's gonna leave. I think he likes this spot and I can't really blame him. The XP is very, very good here. All right, well, let's go back to the hammerhead sharks 
Although the leveling up is a little bit slower, it's a heck of a lot safer. So let's do that for now. Okay, so we managed to hit level 51, and I'm playing around with the tiger sharks right now, but Mosasaurus, he is definitely around here. It's kind of like a little dance that we figured out. I don't mess with him, he doesn't mess with me. Granted, I am eating most of his food, but hopefully he'll just kind of mind his own business, and we can just continue eating these tiger sharks, because man, this XP is fantastic. It's so good, a thousand XP for each of these guys and they just keep spawning, keep them coming. Seems like Mosasaurus kind of backed off. Maybe we got to the point where he's, he's more or less scared of us, I don't know. I mean, he's got way more teeth than we have, but got a huge mouth, so I got that going for me. Look at how many coins we have, 10,000. That's ridiculous, we're never gonna spend all those coins. So I think what I'm gonna do is take this guy to level 100, and I'm hoping that that will be big enough to take down the Megalodon. I really want revenge for him eating our orca friend. Okay, level 100. Yes, there it is. Okay, and we have 15,000 coins. What in the world are we gonna do with 15,000 coins? All right, let's figure out if we're big enough to take down the Megalodon. I am kind of scared. I'm I'm kind of thinking, well, there's the Mosasaurus. I don't think we're, yeah, we're not nearly big enough to take down the Mosasaurus. So this could be, oh no, get away from me. Get away from, stop. Stop attacking me. I will vacuum your soul, stupid Mosasaurus. Back off, man. So I'm thinking that we may have to actually get bigger. I don't know if the Mosasaurus is bigger than the Megalodon, to be honest with you. Let's see if we can eat. Okay, we can eat a great white shark. So that's a pretty good step in the right direction, I would say. Come here, great white. Come here. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. So now we just need to find good old Meggy. Why is this guy suddenly so hard to find? We had no problem finding him earlier. We are definitely way bigger than the Mosasaurus. You can see the difference in our sizes. Oh my gosh, that's beautiful. So now we just need to find Megalodon. Where's he at? Can we eat our own kind? Oh my gosh, we totally can. That's kind of messed up, dude. No regard for your own family. Just swallow them whole. Hey, hey, no, get. Get, oh my gosh, Megalodon, why are you picking a fight with me? I'm bigger than you, you're not supposed to try to eat me. Stop chasing me, stop. He's still, he's still chasing me. This guy doesn't, he doesn't get it. He just, please, please, he's, he's gonna kill me. He's, if he keeps attacking me like this, I am going to die. And I really, really don't want to. It took me a very long time to get to this point. Please leave me alone. Get away from me. I'm stuck. I'm stuck, you guys. Please get me out. I need health. I need energy. I'm eating all these blue orbs that are just glowing in the water. It's weird. Do not like that Mosasaurus. Don't like him at all. Is that, there he is. There he is. Okay, let's do this. The moment we've all been waiting for, please. Please eat him. Eat him whole. Eat him whole. Hey, I can't eat him whole. Oh, can I? I don't, I don't actually know. Did I? Yeah, I just ate him. Oh yeah. Oh, I can totally eat the Megalodon. Oh, look at this. Just, <laughs> let's, let's do it again here. Let's just watch him get chopped. <laughs> That's so good. Oh yes, we did it. We got revenge and now we're eating every single Megalodon that just keeps respawning in this same spot which is ridiculous and awesome and makes me very, very happy. But there you have it, guys. We finally did it. We defeated the Megalosaurus, swallowed him whole as the whale shark, which was a beautiful thing. I'm just sitting here holding the right click and eating these sharks over and over again, and it feels so good. Couldn't beat him as the orca. That's a little disappointing, but maybe we'll come back to it in the future if you guys really enjoy this and you wanna see me do that, be sure to let me know in the comment section down below, but that's gonna do it. If you enjoyed this, be sure to hit that like button, and of course, if you'd like to see more, you can subscribe to my channel by clicking on that little circle with my logo in it right below this window. You can also watch more of my videos by clicking on the sides of the screen. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.